Welcome back to ETV, entertainment television everywhere in the Treasure Valley. Joining us now from the Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure is Anna to tell us a little bit more about the big race. Anna, how are you? Great. Good. Nice. For those people that you know aren't familiar with holding, tell us a little bit more. What is the race? The Race for the Cure. That's exactly what it is. It's a Race for the Cure. So it's a community event um, that we go out and celebrate life um, for women that are surviving breast cancer. Okay. And memory and all the ones that have passed. Wow. Now, as far as, I mean, I've heard of this before many times. I can't say I've participated. Uh, I'm going to have to work on that. But in the meantime, how many years has this been going on? This will be our 13th year. Wow. That's huge. And I know that the support is just massive. Yep. I mean, the numbers of people. Now, how do people get involved with this? Is it a donation type thing? Is it awareness or both? Both. They can register to be a participant. We had over 16,000 participants last year. That's phenomenal. Um, we have over 400 volunteers that help us put the whole thing together, so people can get involved that way as well. Okay, now as and far as... we also do donations. Okay, now as far as the donations go from the participants, do they raise sponsors, or how does that whole process work? Um, you know, they come up with great ideas, but a lot of times people ask for, can you sponsor me in my race? Um, they do different events, bake sales, um, different things throughout the community to raise funds that help go to home. So. Wow. Well, that's awesome. You know, either you can get involved financially, make a donation to one of the participants, or mm -hmm. show up and show your support. Now, as far as the proceeds go, um, where do those actually go to? Is it local? Is it national? Um, a little bit of both. Seventy-five percent of our funds stay here in our 19 service county area, and uh, twenty-five percent goes to our national research fund area, and it's strictly for research. Oh, that's great. I mean, to hear that so much of the money stays so well locally. Yeah, we have 19 counties that we service in southwest Idaho and central Idaho. That's great. Yeah. Um, can you give us some details on when the race is? The race is this Saturday, May 7th. Okay. Um, the expo area starts at 7.30, and the race will start around 9. Okay, and you mentioned the expo area. Where exactly is that? It's at the Park Center headquarters on Park Center Boulevard, 250 Park Center. Okay. Across from the Park Center Pond. All right. Now, it's going on this Saturday. I'm guessing it's too late to get involved. Is that correct? No. We will still take volunteers. We always need volunteers, so you can register for volunteering on our website. And then you also can still sign up for late registration. Um, either on Friday at Packet Pickup or Saturday morning at Race Day. Okay, and then you had mentioned as far as the website goes, can you give us your website information? You bet. It's uh, comanboise.org. Okay, perfect. So if they need any more information, they can also get registered there or they can show up as well. Great. And then also, for those of you that can't make it out there, um, KBOI TV 2 will be broadcasting live beginning at 8.30 for two hours of the opening coverage on Saturday morning. Yeah. Great. Thanks so much. We wish Great. you all the best with the Race for the Cure and keep up the, the fight there. Great. Thank you. Thank you.